lovely people of YouTube. So glad to see you guys again. It's been a minute. Today's video is gonna be a fun one. It's gonna be a homemaking fall video. So kind of more of a laid back video. I'm gonna be cleaning my super messy house. I'm gonna be canning soup for the very first time. Never did that before, so we'll see if that flops or not. I'll be sharing a few of my fall, a recipe or two with you guys. One's a family favorite I know you guys are gonna enjoy. Also just a few of my fall like must have. So it's kind of a vlog style video. I hope you guys enjoy and maybe a little bit of shopping here and there. I don't know. Take you guys along my week, see what all I get up to. Let's get. First of all, we need a home tour of this incredibly messy kitchen and living room. Mm, so bad. So we got home late last night from a cabin. Are you guys the type to unpack right away? Because I used to be that person, that weird, weird, weird person that would unpack right away, have your house all clean, you know, when you wake up. Not anymore. I'm a parent. I'm so tired when I get home. I put the baby to bed and I, I'm out myself. So now I have to deal with my messy house, which is not fun. No one likes to wake up to this, but <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna set a timer, get crack and lacking. If you guys need to have a project or something you've been pushing off or just need to clean your house, work with me. Let's go. Okay, okay. I know I keep interrupting my mom and be like, just get busy. Yes, I need to get busy. But whenever I clean my house, I normally like pick up the phone to FaceTime my sisters or my friend or listen to an audiobook. But today I'm gonna listen to an audiobook. Anna Green Gables collection, like the whole series, is free on audio audible right now. So just a public service announcement. So I have to stop clearly and tell you that it's all free. So go run and listen to it. Are you guys Ellen Montgomery fans like I am? Anyway, I'm listening to Anne's House of Dreams right now. It's so fresh. Okay, gotta go. Let's get busy now, for real. For real, for real, for real, for real. One of my favorite thrifted finds lately is this Casa Luna throw. It's from Target, but I found it for like $8 at a thrift store. It was brand new in packaging. Casa Luna brand, which is one of their higher end brands at Target. And it's so soft and it's just this chunky knit. It's perfect for fall. And I love the texture that it adds to my bed. And oh, anyway, I'm so tickled with it. $8, brand new at a thrift store. Go thrifting people. It's amazing. Interrupting my cleaning and doing something more important, which is reading to her and then putting her to bed. Okay. She needs some mama time. I love to share each day with you, exploring far and wide. Whatever path you take through life, I will be by your side. Can we talk about how pretty this tree is? Oh, it's pretty. Sleep good. Well, now is as good a time as any to talk about today's sponsor. I'm excited about this one. Membrane Solutions Air Purifier. So I was already in the market looking for an air purifier and Membrane Solutions reached out to me and sent me this air purifier. Yeah. This purifier is a top air purifier designed in the US and it can remove 99.99% of bacteria in the air, chemicals, VOCs, tobacco smoke, odors like pet odor and also cooking odors which I'm actually probably gonna keep this thing in the kitchen because I hate the smell of like food frying and all that. Ugh. It also helps remove pollen allergies, which is the main reason why I even wanted one because my allergies are so bad in the fall. Uh. And it also has a child lock, which is super handy because this little girl loves pressing all the buttons all the time. So the child lock is super handy. Also, it's a smart air purifier so you can control the settings on your phone via Wi-Fi. That's really, really handy because I can go on my app, control the setting, do what I want with it. I love that it's really quiet, doesn't make a lot of noise. 
It's also really sleek, so it doesn't take up a lot of room. It is definitely more budget friendly than a lot of air purifiers I was researching earlier. This air purifier's purification area can be up to 1,500 square feet. And they have a deal right now that if you buy this air purifier with two filter replacements, you can also get an MSB3 air purifier for free. And so I'll put a link down below if you guys want to check it out. I have, a, I have a code for you guys to use. Thank you, Membrane Solutions, for sponsoring today's video. I appreciate it. Thank, thank you. Bye. I'm finally done cleaning. My whole house is perfectly clean. Whew, that feels good. My friend Janine just asked if I want to come over for a cup of coffee, and I was like, yes, I do, because I am tired and I need a little break. So heading over there now. Blessed are those whose ways blameless, who walk in the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who keep his testimonies, who seek him with their whole heart, who also do no wrong, but walk in his ways. So if I have time after my devotions, I love to read a little bit. And this book is new to me. I just got it. I'm enjoying it so far. Holy, I don't even know how to say that word. Creating a place for people to gather and the gospel to grow. And then I'm also loving this book. This is just a fun, beautiful book, especially if you love like home decorating and stuff like that. This is just such a fun book to look through. It would make an excellent like birthday gift idea or Christmas gift idea. So keep these in mind. Oh, this time of year, it's so pretty. This is our tree in our front yard. So pretty. Unfortunately, this tree is dying, so we have to cut it down. I am mourning it. I love old trees. And this thing is just huge. Oh, I'm gonna miss it so bad. Summer and I are just out enjoying all the leaves and the beautiful day. We need to go get your sweater on. It's a little bit chilly yet. So in a little bit, my friend Kate's gonna come over and we are gonna have a busy day canning soup. Neither of us have ever canned soup before. So we're gonna see how it works and if it's a good recipe. Well, regardless, I might just share the recipe down below because I'm sure I'm gonna get asked. So we're gonna do ham and potato soup and then you just add the dairy like later and then ham and bean soup. I'm excited, I like both of those soups. I just have never had it like canned. So I hope it doesn't taste like mealy or meh or just a bad texture or something. I hate bad textures. So we'll see how it goes. It's gonna be a busy day. It's more fun to do these kind of things with somebody. So time goes by faster. All the potatoes you gotta chop and everything. It's just so much more fun when you have someone to talk to. So yeah. Best time of the day, Troy's home. Ooh, crazy. Your horsey is pretty wild. Okay, next day here. I'm so tired. I was up to the wee hours of the morning canning this stupid soup. <laughs> um, it just took forever. So we started on it like around 10 in the morning, but then you know, our pressure cookers are kind of small, so it just took forever, we had so much soup. But I feel like it turned out good. I opened a can last night, and it was a ham and bean soup, and then ham and potato soup, and then we added some corn to it too, because corn is good. Anyway, but I feel like it turned out good. It was definitely a learning curve. First batch is kind of like meh, and then the second batch was better. Anyways, so I'll link the recipes down below that we tried, and then we also, you know me, I can't follow a recipe. We also added like more spices and seasonings and stuff because without it, it's just a little bit like meh. But today's gonna be more, a little bit more chill because I'm tired. Anyways, and, but yeah, I wanna show you a few of my other favorite things, so. Okay, while the baby's playing, it is so nice out here, so I'm filming out here. Let me show you a few of my favorite things that I'm loving right now. These cards, aren't they? so beautiful. I will link the person down below that makes them. I just think they're just the most like warm, inviting. How cute are these? I'm actually planning to frame a couple of these cards in my kitchen and stuff because I, this is the same one. Here's another one. I just think they're 
They are just so beautiful and I just love it. I will post her Instagram shop. Here's another one. And I just think she is so talented. Okay, another item that's kind of random. It's this huge tote bag. I have been looking for such a tote with a zipper. It had to have a zipper for me, but it's this oversized bag. I wanted it because, okay, it kind of looks more like summer than fall. I wanted a, a bag this size forever because when you go camping or to the cabin or to the beach, anywhere you go, even like soccer practice or whatever you want to do, you want a bag that can hold all the things, like one bag for all the things. That's what I've been looking for. Um, there's always just like a bunch of like, you know, things you want to throw in last minute. I wanted a bag that could do all of that. So absolutely love this huge bag so far. Need a Christmas gift idea for somebody, get them one of these bags. There's different colors and stuff, but, and it has a zipper because otherwise stuff just falls out. So anyway, enormous tote bag, love it. And while we're on the subject of cards, I got my Christmas card done already and it's only October. Where's my prides? I mean, come on. We took these pictures ourselves in the apple or in an apple orchard. And anyway, Simple Design Company made the made these cards for me and they did such a good job and they gave me a code for you guys to use. So if you want to support a small family business, I'll leave a link down below as well as my code. And if you want to send us a Christmas card, do. I love getting mail. Oh, it's my favorite time of day to go out and get the mail. So I'll put my address down below just in case you feel like you know what? I have extra cards this year. I'll send, her, I'll send her one. Sure, why not? Also, I've talked about this candle different times. These guys need to sponsor me because hold it. I talk about this candle and I love it so much. The Welsh Mountain Company Cinnamon Clove Candle. I'm all about candles this time of year. Every single day I burn a couple candles and so this is one that you need to put on your list. Okay guys, I gotta get scrambling because people are coming over for dinner in just a little bit. We decided to have people over because the weather is just beautiful and I wanna sit outside while we still can. So I'm gonna be sharing one of my favorite family recipes with you guys and just kind of sharing the menu with you as well. And I'll link as many of the recipes down below as I can because I know I like to have new ideas too, especially when I'm serving people, just like crowd friendly ideas or something that's super simple because I honestly, um, I only have, they're, they're coming like pretty shortly and I have to get crack it lock and hopefully the baby's gonna be good because I got lots to do. Okay, so the first recipe I'm gonna share with you guys is the sweet potato biscuits. So this is a family recipe, sweet potato biscuits with honey butter. I make these so often when I host because they're always a hit. They're just delicious. They might sound weird because like a sweet potato biscuit, but sweet potato biscuit and then you have to serve it with honey, whipped honey butter. Ugh, so good. And then I'm doing a um, Caesar salad. I'll link that recipe. It's from my friend Dorcas Keim and she has a really good homemade um, Caesar salad dressing and it's just so much better than store-bought. And I'm having, thank God it's fried chicken, which I'm not sure if I'll be able to share that recipe just because it's from a cookbook, but I'll see if she has a recipe online. And brown butter potatoes. So I gotta get busy. And also a pumpkin dessert. I was gonna make like this beautiful fall cake with like beautiful toppings and everything. And I am not managing my time well today, so I don't have time to do that. So I'm gonna do a pumpkin crunch dessert, which if you guys have never done that, I'm sure a lot of y'all have, but this pumpkin crunch dessert is the perfect fall recipe. It is so easy, so easy. I can do it in like five minutes, and then you have to bake it or whatever, and it's served with vanilla ice cream, and it's just delicious. So the recipe calls for cooked sweet potatoes, but I prefer just buying them from Aldi. Um, cut sweet potatoes in syrup. I think these make the best biscuit. This potato recipe takes about seven minutes and your Instant Pot is the fastest, quickest, easiest recipe and it's delicious. So uh, make sure you check it out. And I'm watching a wedding today while I'm working. Congratulations, Marvin and Rachel. I wish you could be there today in person. Much better than online. Butter! Just add a little bit more butter. So much butter in this. That's what makes it good. Brown butter. <clears throat> Put like little crumbs on top yet. It's so good. Too much food, the same color. My bad.
the pine cone. We're in the woods doing a little family hike. Anyways, I think I'm gonna end the video here, but I just wanna say if you haven't went hiking in the fall yet this year, go hiking! Even if you don't necessarily enjoy it normally, go because it is so refreshing and it's so much fun and so beautiful. This little girl is absolutely loving it. She's in her element, um, just exploring everywhere. It's hard to keep up with her. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Let me know if you enjoyed it. If you like my videos or comment, it helps me know that you are enjoying what you're seeing and I'll do more like it. So have a good rest of your week and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Can you say bye? Oh, okay. Bye guys. You're so dirty. Look at you. See if I'll get these stains out. I don't know. Don't know. Happy kids are dirty ones. Sometimes. Mm -mm.